gini do riba cakke we mo ali wa rio ka be en itu ni cakke kom la tin en pa o ga ke do ngwa tin pa o we ne ko ne Nodding disease first emerged in Sudan in the 1980s. A neurological disease characterized by episodes of head nodding and seizures, it now affects a growing number of children in Uganda, Sudan and Tanzania. So far, research into the disease has been inconclusive. There's little understanding of the disease, no known treatment and no cure. This nodding disease is really very bad because it's really affecting children from 15 years below. Above 15 years, they don't get the disease. And these ones who are already affected are very many. In the area where I work, the numbers have reached now 320. For me now, sincerely, I am stuck. I don't know what is taking place because we really try to control the fits, but sometimes they cannot be controlled. We give them drugs, we go for follow up, and you find that they are still fitting like that. So exactly, we can't tell. Out of the 320, already about three died. And with all these people who have already got the children who has the nodding disease, there is no hope for them. Given the lack of medical help available to sufferers of nodding disease, life for those who care for them at home becomes a difficult and frustrating experience. This woman is the sole carer of her grandson, who's been suffering from nodding disease for the past seven years. <laughs> Because food brings on the nodding fits, patients develop a fear of eating and literally waste away. <laughs> <laughs> 